Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to unbox something from Hermes and I also have another little thing that I'm also going to unbox. So yeah, let's get into the video. If you're new to my channel, my name is Malin and I do videos and vlogs about luxury fashion, handbags and shoes. So if that's something you like, please consider subscribing to my channel and click the notification bell so you don't miss any of my future videos. So yeah, it is a long time since I last did an unboxing on my channel, so therefore I felt for it today. So a little story time if you haven't seen my vlog or if you saw it and don't remember. A week ago I was going to Hermes and that was because I wanted to check out the boutique and talk a little bit with my essay. I haven't talked with her since last time I was here. A little here and there, but not that much so I just planned to go into the store and look at what they had and yeah so I went to the store and I was waiting a little bit for her I didn't have an appointment with her because she was all busy so I didn't have any expectations for something to happen or to buy something I just wanted to see and try and and maybe buy something if I really liked it but she gave me an idea before I came that she didn't have any of those things that I was looking for so therefore I didn't go to the boutique and was in a shopping mood uh, but when I came I just looked a little bit on my own and after that she came and then I tried on many shoes um, <laughs> as you know I am a shoe addict I really love shoes but I also love bags but shoes are something that I really like and she was so nice I tried on many shoes and I also tried on some of the shoes that I also asked about that they didn't have but I ended up not getting them because I felt that they were either too narrow or they weren't my style and so I didn't end up buying something but I did end up getting three bag offers one quarter bag and one semi quarter bag it was the Kelly Allen and the last bag was the Maximo I think it is called it is from the runway show um, but I did say no to every single one of them because they weren't something that I would feel that I want in my collection, especially now. Now I'm more prioritizing those staple pieces and after that I feel that I can have a little bit fun with my bags, but I want to get my staple pieces before I get the fun bags, if you understand. <laughs> Um, so I did say no to every single one of them and I was a little bit scared to say no because you all know the Hermes game, it is hard. But I think it was the right decision because I really like the Kelly Ellen but it wasn't something that I want now. I would much rather get a Kelly 25 or a Mini Kelly and I feel that I wouldn't use the Kelly Ellen that much. And also I have fallen in love with the Kelly Ellen with ostrich feathers. So that was also a reason why I said no, because I felt that the normal one would be a little bit less extra. And I feel that I wouldn't satisfy my obsession for the Kelly Ellen with feathers if I bought the normal Kelly Allen. But I know that uh, Kelly Allen with feathers is a runway piece, but I would still wait for another thing that really catches my eye than going for something that I want but not want that much. I ended up saying no and I left the appointment. I was very happy but I was also a little bit sad at the same time and I think this was on Wednesday and I got a text on Friday that they have received my item in the boutique and I went there today to pick it up and I tried it on and it was perfect. So that was the story time and also before I went to the Hermes boutique to pick up uh, the item I also went to Swatch and I know this is a little bit off brand <laughs> um, but I went to Swatch and the reason for that is because they have the Omega campaign which is called the Moon Swatch. So me and my boyfriend have managed to score two and you can probably guess what it is but here it is the bag and let's take it out. <laughs> so here is the simple packaging. It is not a very exciting reveal. <laughs> but I managed to score another watch. So this is the mission to Saturn. So here you can see all the different moon swatches. And these are very hard to get as well because they get them every day, but they sell out immediately. And I was just so lucky to score one when I just went to the boutique and asked randomly. So here is my watch. 
this is the Saturn and as you can see it is very much like the Omega watch it is very lightweight so here you can see the watch it is very cool I think and the strap I will change it out because the strap isn't that great because it is a velcro strap so <laughs> I would definitely change it out and yeah here is my new watch and I'm very happy with it I really love the colors on this one and therefore I picked it and I will also try it on and then you will probably see what I mean about the strap I think it is horrible so here you can see how the watch looks on me and the strap and here you can see the velcro <laughs> it isn't that nice uh, but I'm going to change out the strap that was my first purchase of the day and after that I went straight to Hermes and here is the item from Hermes I don't normally take white bags in Norway because my boyfriend is carrying it but today I had to go in and pick it up alone so therefore I said yes to the white bag <laughs> And also I feel that the white bags are much more needed here in Paris when it comes to robberies and anything like that. So I would gladly say yes to a white bag. <laughs> and here is the other bag inside the white bag. So here is the box. Can you guess what it is? Now is the time to guess in the comment section what do you think it is. I am very excited about this item because I have wanted an item like this for such a long time and yeah, let's unbox it. And, and now you can probably tell it is shoes of course. I did wish it was a mini Kelly but I'm crossing my fingers and toes and everything that I have for a mini Kelly very soon but this is also something that I really really want and let's take it out so let me introduce you to my new cyper sandals these are in the color natural I think it is called um, in suede and just look at this gorgeous color now it looks a little bit more orange than they are it is a very rich brown it is a little bit lighter than for example gold but it is just so stunning <laughs> so i had to get them and i'm so happy with my purchase and i also tried them on in the store just to be sure that they were the right size because these are in 38 and a half and they were perfect and also I have to mention that I think the suede leather is a little bit softer than on my normal inbox I felt immediately that these were much more comfortable to wear than the ones that I have so that's a very good plus about them and let's take out the other shoe as well so you can see it together so here they are together and I cannot wait to style them because they are so insane and thank you so much to my essay I really really like them and I'm so happy um, so that was my cyber sandals now I have four pairs because I sold my ones in white because they were giving me blisters and hopefully these will not give me blisters and I will style them to death and I will of course take them with me to Oslo when I'm leaving for Oslo. That was my new Cyper Sounds and I will also try them on for you guys. I just love them so much and I was so lucky to score them. They are so hard to get especially in suede and also the price is the same for these ones like the box ones. The retail price is 635 which isn't that bad but Again, it is just sandals. I love them so much and I will take them with me wherever I'm going this summer and I will use them a lot. So that was my latest Hermes purchase and hopefully I'm getting a mini Kelly very soon. I really hope that I get one because I want it so bad. Um, but I'm still trying here in Paris and hopefully one day it will be my lucky day. But until then I am still very happy with my collection but I feel that I need a small evening bag especially for the Parisian life and that was the 
little haul or Hermes unboxing. Um, I just wanted to make something different because I know that most of my videos now have been vlogs. And I also wanted to ask you guys what you prefer. Do you prefer vlogs and unboxings together? Or do you prefer them in two different videos? Because now quite recently I have done an instant unboxing on my vlogs. So let me know in the comments what you guys think. What do you want? Do you want the unboxing inside vlogs or do you want to separate videos? I'm very happy when I get some advice from you guys. So let me know. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you're not done watching me yet, here is another video and goodbye.